Atlantic or Pacific, which ocean really breeds the deadliest hurricanes? The Pacific Ocean churns out far more tropical cyclones every year. The Western Pacific, in particular, is the most active storm zone on Earth, where hurricanes are called typhoons. They can swell into giants the size of entire countries, whipping winds strong enough to level buildings and push walls of water over coastlines. But here's the catch. The Pacific is vast. Many of its fiercest storms spend their lives spinning over endless open water, fading before they ever touch land or striking remote islands far from the world's attention. The Atlantic, however, plays a different game. It spawns fewer storms, but when it does, they often have a direct runway towards some of the most densely populated coasts on the planet, the US East Coast, the Gulf of Mexico, and the Caribbean. That's where millions live, work, and depend on vulnerable infrastructure. Picture this, a Category 3 hurricane slamming into Miami, New Orleans, or San Juan. Streets vanish under storm surge. Skyscrapers sway under relentless winds. Millions evacuate. Losses skyrocket into the billions. And the world watches in real time. Timing is another factor. The Atlantic hurricane season runs from June 1st to November 30th, peaking in late summer when the ocean is a vast cauldron of warm water and the atmosphere offers just the right conditions for explosive growth. So who wins? The Pacific may dominate in numbers, but the Atlantic takes the crown for sheer impact. Fewer storms, yes, but when they make landfall, they're among the most feared, most destructive forces on Earth. Follow for more jaw-dropping facts about our beloved globe.